It's a cold one, but the sun's coming out. Thank God, keep me warm. Got the gloves on. <clears throat> Today, I just took the glass off this stove here. Because this one needs a control panel, so I just took the glass off that one. I'm going to replace it on this one here. Hopefully it fits. I measured it. <clears throat> Should be exact fit. Hopefully, I'm going to take the old glass off. These things are a pain in the ass. To take the to put the burners back on underneath this glass here, oh, there you go. It's a pain in the ass, but we're gonna switch the glass. Be careful, it's cold. But yeah, somehow I'm gonna have to elevate these burners <clears throat> on that one up so I can screw them in. Cause you basically gotta hold this up and bolt two screws on each side. So it's gonna be a little bit of a challenge, but I'll get it done. Just waiting for the sun to come a bit more, keep get get it warm enough so my hands don't freeze. I'll just put it here, let it warm up a bit. So I'm gonna be doing that today, replacing the glass there because she's cracked. I don't know if you can see the crack right along there, all the way down. The stove works, just the glass has to be replaced. <clears throat> I'm gonna get this dryer down here because that's got a lot of change in it, go through it and See if I can fix it. The whirlpool needs a clutch. I mean, a roper made by whirlpool. Yep. What a day. Oh my God. This one's okay. She's ready to go. And I got Samsung dryer there that has no heat that I got yesterday too. Blocked in here now. It's kind of insane. I don't know what happened. One day everything just goes into a disaster. I gotta get rid of stuff. That's it. I'm not buying anything no more. I'm done. I told Eric, don't come back for a while. I gotta sell some stuff, make some space here now. It's absolutely ridiculous. I posted all these printers online. 500 bucks, take it all for best offer. I don't even take 400 bucks. I paid 100. If I profit 300, I don't care. 200, good enough. I think it's worth it. All these cartridges here. We got one, one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven total. Four hundred bucks, not a bad deal. Okay, just warming up a bit, having my coffee. When the sun comes a bit more higher, get when I warm everything warms up a bit, and we'll go from there. Replace that glass on the stove. What you giving? That's how we live it. Don't be mad at the system. It's simply how we've existed. That was scary. These things are so fragile if you work on these stoves here. My god, I just did the screw nice and slow, let it drop down, drop down. The hardest part now is bolting them back up. Screw on each side of this plate goes up. I hope I didn't destroy anything when it fell because these are this is an old stove. So all these little windings here are so brittle. You touch them, they'll break. So I gotta be very, very, very careful hooking it back up. But it is a perfect match. It's got the clips on the end, the same as the other one. What do I do with it? Where do I put it? Oh, shit, scared me. Oh my God, that fell off the truck. Right here. <clears throat> this is it here. Same clips on the end, which slides in. So it should be a perfect match. The hard part is now is bolting those things back up. Hands are frozen right now. Frozen, you gotta warm up a bit. Cause once I start it, I can't stop. I gotta get them right up there, screw and put it together. And she's done, if I don't screw it up. If I don't screw it up. Now this is the plate that fell. I had it on the truck, which goes back this way on the front here, like that. I guess the saw even lost the screw on this. I'll find it. Can't put stuff on the truck. I'll put it right here. Let my hands warm up, warm up, and I'll install it. Hands are frozen. Oh, got it in. They're all put in. What a pain in the ass to get those back up there. They're in. But it's not going back all the way. I don't understand not going back all the way I think I just has a ridge here and this doesn't have a ridge oh man it's already almost exactly the same what's going on unless I'm putting it in wrong but I can't seem to get it in there 
keep trying to see what happens. I was looking at this stove. I might have to replace the whole side piece. So if I take that side piece, that's gonna be a perfect match. But is the side piece on this all the other stove gonna fit into that piece? See if I change the side piece, it's gonna work. I only got one screw there, one there. This side piece should come off easy and just swap it. Now is it, I'm just worried about is it gonna fit into this groove here. So I'll have to measure it up. It looks, I don't know, it looks the same. Maybe not, it goes down. Will that work? Will that side piece work? You know what, why not? It's a part stove now, let's do it. Let's see what happens. Cause she's not going in cause it's right here is different. Why would it make them all different? That's crazy, what is this? This is a Kenmore, like, and it's also a Kenmore too. Like, how many times they change the patterns on these stoves? Like it's almost exact same stove. Make no sense. All right, we got that piece out. I don't know, this would be amazing if this fits. I don't think it's even got the shape of it. I have to change the whole front panel. So it's set like that. You know what? I think this might work. It sets on that. Hang on, guys. I don't know if you guys can see. There's one screw at the top. One screw matches the side. One screw at the bottom there, you can see. This slides right in, and there's another second screw. Why would not work? I think that might work. And basically, I don't think they changed that much. That holds the panel, and it sets into there. So we're gonna try to put the side panels to match that glass top. If this works, I'll be amazed. We'll try one side first. Oh, don't drop it on the glass. All right, wish me luck, guys. This is crazy. All right, I got that piece in. Here's the other piece I took off. You know what? That looks pretty close to me. Look at that, it's touching. If it only holds this up straight enough, it might be good. The screws there is lining up with that one, I think. Which one is it? I'm all confused now. Oh yeah, the hole there. I can bend that down a bit. Oh, you guys can see here, hang on. I can move those up and down to, to light up the holes. But you know what? I think this might work. There's the other one, but got one in so far. I'm gonna connect it and see what, what it looks like and go from there. I think it's gonna work. I don't know. I can't get that inside because then this panel is sticking upwards like that. But you know what? This is gonna work but it just has to go on the outside. It's gonna be a little bit disinformation. Like, if nobody cares about that, right? The look of it, who cares? But it's gonna work. We got our matching piece now. Well, that's gonna slide all the way in. The bottom, it still looks okay. And you're not gonna see the wires or anything. Hope not. But look at that. The only problem here is that screw's gonna go there easy. Where is it? I'm gonna get that screw in there easy. Here I'm not. I might have to self tap one there at the top. I'll just self tap a screw there. Down here, I might have to self tap again. I'll just tapping screw there. And I think, I think it's gonna work. It's gonna look a lot better than me forcing this in there and leaving a big gap, it wouldn't even go. But now it's just gonna go in. That's gonna line up perfect. This is gonna be sticking out. This piece here, she's still gonna set okay, right? What do you think? Continue with the other side? Cause everything lines up pretty much except for the front. So I just wanna make sure before I take the other side apart and it's not gonna work, I'll have to put it all back together again. But yeah, I think it's gonna work. Like that's gonna line up. I'll self tap there, self tap there. 
and it's gonna set like that. It's setting up, or it goes back. It's still not that high up, it's okay. Look at that. I've replaced glass tops before, they're a pain in the ass. I wouldn't advise anybody to do it. But I've never done this kind of a job before. But it's gonna work out, guys. It's gonna work, all right. I'm gonna continue the other side and put it all together and show you the finished product, guys. Almost there. Now I got the other side on here. So we're almost there. Pain in the ass because this plate's in the middle of the hole of the screw there. So I gotta keep bending that plate at the same time you're taking the screw out. But we're almost there. We're gonna see the end result, guys. All right, this is it, guys. It's on. I'm gonna get myself a small screwdriver because I don't have space. My screwdriver tightened those screws right in the bottom on both sides, pain in the ass. But I got it on. So this is the only problem it's gonna have. I'm gonna self tap it there and self tap the corner. Basically, she's all bolted in. Two screws in the bottom. So this side's gonna look like this. I have no choice. And then that, she's all the way down. And this side's gonna look like this. But she works. All right, this doesn't look bad. Soft tap the screw in there, and she's all good to go. Slide the glass in, screw it up, and that's it. Yeah, she's done. All right, this is the idea I used. Put a little monkey wrench on the end of this, like that, and tick, tick, and all done. All right, on to the next step. All right, she's in. I just hope my front screws line up now. But she's right in. So this could have been a, a defect in the factory, who knows. But she's all lined up, all in. The front looks okay. Just gonna put the screws in. All lined up, she's in. Someone might not even notice that. It's hard to tell. Because you look at one side and look at the other side, you're not gonna remember the other side, right? <laughs> She looks okay. A few self tap screws. Glass is on. Now it's gonna put the trim back on here. The only thing that goes down here is that trim where I put it. Oh, it's inside. There's a trim at the bottom here that extends it. You guys can see that. Let me see. That will extend it to screw on. You guys can see that, but yeah, she's done. All right, give her a nice little clean. Pretty clean anyways, she's spotless and it's conventional too. Glass is replaced, doesn't look as nice as the other glass that's cracked, but still looks pretty good. I did it, Carmack one did it. All right guys, on to the next project. Get the big piggy bank out of the truck and see what's in there. All right, the stove's complete. Now we're just cleaning this money out of this dryer here. You guys can see here, let's just tilt it down a bit. I'm taking the money out. Oh. What the hell? Hang on a sec. Get my tripod. I don't know, I shouldn't have probably posted those stupid things on Marketplace. People are asking how many questions. Do you have this? Do you have that? Do you have this? Do you have this? Do you have that? That's not even all of it there. Some keys, loonies, loonies, toonies, more loonies, dimes, quarters, quarters, more loonies. There's quite a bit here. And you can see it all in there, see it? There's lots and lots and lots. I gotta keep shaking it. We're getting a lot of money out of this one here. This dryer scrap anyway is good for parts. I'll keep shaking it out. 
No, I'm gonna set these guys here. Get some of the action here. All right. On that one, breaking the bank. in there oh my god there's lots in there I'm gonna get my magnet there's lots in there I'll get the magnet look at it all everywhere oh my god that's a good piggy bank I'd say to my collection that's what we got so far out of it <coughs> I'm going to take it apart some more. Okay, ladies, no barkings. Okay, I'm going to put the money away. My toonies, loonies go in the toonie, loonie jar, toonie jar, loonie jar. And my quarters all go in that. So that's what we got. A good $15 of toonies and loonies. And I'm going to put the rest in there. My toonie jar is right here in loonies. Hey, cookies. And now this dryer money goes in the dryer jar. And it's getting pretty full here. I'd say so. I'm gonna fill this whole jar up. And this is all laundry. Dryer money. Let's fill her up. All right, guys, Carmac One is home. Having a break, frustrating today. But anyways, like and subscribe, guys. Take care.